Hey, what's going on world? It's Alex Acosta and I'm back with another fun, quick, and easy tutorial inside of Vegas. AI auto frame. That is exactly what we're focusing on today. I had the pleasure of directing not only a talented actor, but a talented artist as well, Rotimi. I swear that you are so special. I'm here to make you feel special. I'll treat you to something special. Because we got something special. And now that the music video is done, I need to get the artists or their clip outs. And in this particular case, we're going to give it to them a 9 by 16 vertical. Let's jump in. And as you see right here, we got the file. I already cut down to the uh, to exact time that I need it. Um, let's go to video effects. And we are looking for AI auto reframe. Drop it over the clip. And you see right here, this box pop up. Let's instantly go to show preview four. We want to go to portrait nine by 16. And you see these white bars automatically pop up, letting you know what's going to be centered in frame. So regardless of where we scrub on the timeline, it's just letting you know that that's what's going to be um, in your pretty much in the middle for nine by 16. Now, in this case, we know music videos shift. We know plenty of scenes jump around and we know the artist isn't always in the middle. So we'll look for the best finds we could have of the artist being in the middle. And let's just say it wasn't a lot going on in this music video. You could hit follow subject right here and it was try its best to follow who would think the subject is in the frame. And again, when you have a music video with a lot of people in it, kind of wouldn't recommend this option, but if it was just one, two people walking around, you could uh, um, definitely use this option. But we're gonna click this off. And this one, we're gonna go with allow manual manipulation because we're gonna change some of the frame. Okay, so you see when I put my cursor over the screen, it allows me to move this box. So let's move the box over to where Rotimi is. And let's go over a couple frames and see where he slides out and I'm not comfortable as far as his position. Uh, right here, he gets out of frame. Let's say we wanna align him before he gets out of frame. So right here, I see at the timing, see on the left side is 612. So I'm gonna go right here into this box and I'm gonna type in, oops, sorry. I'm gonna type in 612, hit enter. And I know right there, I'm allowed to move this keyframe a little over and let's keep going. And I just, by the way, that just created a keyframe as you see there. We're gonna keep going. Yeah, let's see. And right here is clearly out of frame. So this is at 909. Let's jump over to 909. Hit enter. And you see, I'm going to hit it and right, I reposition them. And that's the new keyframe that is made. And we repeat this process. So really quick, I'm going to put this on fast mode starting right now. Okay, and we back. And as you see, a couple keyframes was created. And as you see, as I scrub over, you see the box moving left to right that's the rep the different positions where I wanted the box so it could be centered. And then once you're done, what you wanna do is hit reanalyze and it's gonna reanalyze all the uh, keyframes that you just made. And to finalize it, you just hit project aspect ratio. And now it's going to uh, read all the keyframes that you made and this is the final. And that my friends is how to use AI auto reframe inside of Vegas. Hope you didn't mind that in my tutorial, I showed you a music video. I could have made it way more simpler than a talking headshot of an interview, but I wanted to add a little bit more intricate details and use it in real life scenarios that you guys might use it in. So I hope you didn't mind that I went the extra step to show you how to use it for a music video. Till next time, and be sure to check out that video with Flo Rider, Rotimi, and Spice Energy. Cheer! You should know that I'm here, girl.